Hello, and welcome back. This is match two. We won the die roll, which is great for this deck. And we have our yeah pretty good curve, so keeping this. A few elements from all of our strategies here. We get to play out a turn one Basilisk Collar, and maybe equip that to a Pinger later on. But early, ah, oh, that's pretty good. Equip two. We can use that anytime. Uh, I'm just going to do it now. I'm going to get rid of this Dragon Master Outcast. I, I don't want to deal with it later. Polluted Delta. What is it getting? So blue-red, at least. And Fire Slinger. Well, we can revoke that. All right, that's close enough. Fire Slinger. That's equipped for two, so no deal there. See, Phyrexian Revoker is like a, a good Planeswalker. It protects itself. Well, it doesn't protect itself that well, I suppose. Do we want to get rid of this? No, I think Basilisk Color is going to make the Revoker better on offense here. Ooh, Chasm Skulker. Chasm Skulker. Yeah, let's just let's just kill that Chasm Skulker. And hopefully we can save our Chandra here. But if they have a way to deal with Revoker, and they certainly have the colors to do it. Yeah, that's rough. Fire Diamond. There's the ramp. At least we dealt with the Skulker before they got any squids out of it. Now we're up to five. We need to find white, and we need to find five more mana. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Cranko Mob Boss. <coughs> No, they're doing the same thing. Yeah, we lose this game. Sorry, that that's just the Fire Slinger and Basilisk color combo. We can't beat it. So let's see what we can do here. They they add blue. I'm gonna bring in Jaya Ballard for Kamano and Murderous Red Cap will help speed things up as well. Try not to pull our trick where we play too too many lands or uh, too many cards. Actually, I could see cutting a land. I'm gonna do that. We go to 16. Wait, did we did we screw it up again? I thought I took out two cards and put in two cards. Unless we had a main deck of 41 to begin with. How many lands are we playing? <laughs> this is embarrassing. I'll have to check that last time or uh, next time. It's a league, so we can recover from it. But <clears throat> yeah, keeping this. Good, good hand. It'll be a nice early, and they're down to six. I think we we're just playing 18 lands to begin with. Oh, no, we were because of Maze of Ith. I don't know. I don't know what it is. What have we done wrong? So hopefully we draw some kind of land here. Devil's Play. Huh. Orcish Artillery? Or something else? Oh, I'll do Orcish Artillery. Because now we have the option of killing Fire Slinger if, it, if they don't have their Basilisk color right away. And we'll only take net one from this, so that's not too bad with the color. Come on. Don't <laughs> do not do it. Don't flame slash our artillery. Don't stagger shock him and ping him. That's why blue-red is so scary. It's, it's so versatile. 
Okay, that's not too bad. Excellent. Now we need a land. If we get a land, we can go heart into equip color. Excellent. Excellent. This is great. We should be able to react to anything in time here. All right, they're going to keep their mana up, and that's fine. I don't need to kill the outcast immediately. I can kind of go for the fire slinger first. Because even if they deal with the artillery, we'll have devil's play to, to worry about. Bam. Kill that fire slinger. So we go to 18. 17. <laughs> Wait. The damage we deal oh, to ourselves is negated? It's much better than I thought. Because, yeah, life, you know, if he's dealing damage to you, it's still lifelink. Wow. <laughs> That's so good. That's much better than I thought it was. Good game. Yeah, let's get Swamp. Because why not? Wow. Yeah, you thought you were the only one with a good combo. We have it, too. Another deep analysis. Hopefully they don't find this um, something to kill our Basilisk color in response to our activation. Wouldn't be the end of the world, I suppose. But yeah, let's kill the outcast and keep on killing things when we can. Well, that's why I conceded last game, because this is what you were going to do to me. Oh, wow. Um, seven? We can get four of their cards? That might be worthwhile. But I don't want to sacrifice Heart of Round, though, so I'm going to wait. Wait for them to play something. So let's come in with the, the Simulacrum. I guess I wouldn't be too sad trading it, because we haven't made our land drop for the turn. And there's no real reason to leave it to block. The other thing we could do here is kill one with the artillery. But I kind of want the, the card draw. And, oh, I should have played Sparksmith. What am I thinking? Static Caster. <clears throat> so, let's let that resolve and kill it before they can do anything crazy. Okay. Good deal. Should have played the Sparksmith that turn, but... This is already so nuts that they needed to find a way to deal with it. Okay, so what else are we doing here? Rolling Earthquake might be a nice way to... I don't know, deal with a bunch of annoying creatures. I might put that in. We'll be back on the draw. Or not back in, but... Good lord, what are we doing here? So we do want this many lands, because one of them is Maze of Ith. So I'm trying to think where this extra land came from, or where this extra card came from. I'm just going to take out a mountain. Because we'll be on the draw. We should have more shots at getting it. And do we want Rolling Earthquake? That's the question. I think we do. And we can take out Murderous Redcap, I guess. Or maybe Devil's Play. I mean, they're both good. 
But I do want another creature. I'll leave Devil's Play in. All right. I'm happy with this. Down to a reasonable sized deck. And Rolling Earthquake could just bail us out of so many situations. If we're already hurting for life, it's not as good. But if we can design a, a situation, it's also very good in this hand. Yeah, I don't mind. Ooh, that's mean. I'm going to do it, though. Get out of here, Volcanic Island. <laughs> I'm in no rush, but that might screw their colors for a while. Mog Fanatic might find a target before we want to use Rolling Earthquake, so I'm fine with that. Force Spike. Okay, great. It got rid of Force Spike. Sparksmith. Well, we could also... <laughs> this is pretty mean, but we, we could Rolling Earthquake to just get the Sparksmith. No, I think... I think that's got to be wrong. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I'm definitely doing it now. On one. Play around days. <laughs> you know, good old fashioned two for one. Puts us both down to 18. And then, you can't ask for much more out of that. Ah, oh, I should have played um, Spike Shot Elder. Oh well, live and learn. I can play now. Get up to a reasonable amount of mana. And I think, if we get Krenko out early enough... Oh, they did have days. <clears throat> That's okay. This is working out surprisingly well for, for what we're doing. If we played the Spike Shot Elder earlier, they would have had, I mean, they might have missed another land drop this turn. They might have drawn it, but they had to use that for days. And now they're all out of that stuff, so it's time. Well, we could wreck this return for a little bit, but I think I'd rather start with um, Krenko. And th that might be enough to make them concede. This has not been a great draw for them. And that really punished them with the uh, Wasteland. Flame Slash. All right, all right. <clears throat> Reasonable. Now we can tear apart their hand with a Rakdos Return. They don't have white mana for the other uh, Force Spike effect, which is Mana Tithe. So let's just go for the full damage. And yeah, choose four of your three cards. That is good. To be fair, we don't really have much to do. But we can deal with Fairy Conclave. We've got Stagger Shock. They're out of cards. So we have the board presence. They don't. Should be good. Yeah, all the... All the things. So we don't have our Orcish Artillery up, so we'll just use this to kill their land. That'll be very annoying for them. Oops, what are we clicking? Get our Sparksmith in play. Fumarole's pretty good. It's not as good as this Chandra. We'll, we'll do this. So we exile, what, a land? Yeah. That's an orc, so this only does one. I'll swing in with one of these guys. If they attack with the Fumeral, that's fine. But if they go to switch the power and toughness, I'll, I'll uh, do one to it. Is it Static Caster? Ugh. Oh no. <laughs> Each creature with the same name, so it's going after that thing. 
I guess I'm fine with that. We can kind of kill that, or we can kind of ki kind of kill our opponent. So I'm kind of into the killing our opponent plan. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So let's plus the top here. No, do two. Wait, what? Oh, we'll just attack with Sparksmith. And Devil's Play to finish things off. Yeah, that, that game was a bit rough. Between the Rakdos return for the rest of their hand and the Wasteland on their first play. Got it, so on to the finals.